Can I find my... Oh, that's not cool. Yo, what is going on my people? We are back doing another video for you guys today. Today we are playing Not All There. This is another top horror game on itch.io, so I thought we would take a deep dive at this. But if you haven't already, if you're new, make sure you go ahead, hit that subscribe button, hit the like button. I do appreciate all the support you guys have been giving me as of late. So, with all that said, let's dive right on in. It's connected to my controller. For the first time that I did not want my game controller to work on a horror game, it wants to work to the point where it disables my keyboard. So this is going to be fun. Game looks nice though. Do appreciate the game. He's listening to the creepy radio. What the heck? I'm pretty sure he's a hazard. This dude's psychotic. Why are you driving a nice Mercedes Benz in a circle? Freaking weird, man. How? How though? But okay, I guess that's uh, we can't go up there. That's fine. Okay, we gotta take the stairs. Run, rabbit, run, run, run. I can't interact with it. This dude is psychotic. First off, you're driving around in circles like a mad person. It's a freaking stuffed rabbit on top of the stairs. And then on top of that, you have somebody's blood on the wall in weird penmanship. Okay, I'm gonna just go around here. I don't think I don't think he even bothered noticing me. It's freaking creep, bro. We about to get bodied tonight. It's over. We about to get bodied tonight. Overlooked. Bro, you good, homie? Oh, he he gone. He dead, dead. It's all bad, man. All right, well, uh, you, you sit there. Um, yo, my character is like traitor. What the heck? Okay, I can interact with this. Oh, okay. You gotta drag it? That's freaking cool. It's like amnesia. Oh, my boy, he got out of his car. He was watching me the whole time he got out of his car, bro. I'm de Nah, dude. You got it, Chief. You got it. Y'all don't have enough of breathing in my ear, all right? I'm not that. I'm not the type of guy, you know. Like you, you can chill out with that. Did we, did we escape? Can I find my? Oh, that's not cool. Bro, oh my God! Stop this. My boy done bodied himself. That was like disembodied body parts. What the heck, man? They up there doing a whole ritual. I hate the fact that I can't turn around real quick. <laughs> I hate that. Yo, my vision is all hazy, too. What the heck's going on, dude? Wait a minute. Yo, initial D. Yo! Hey, that's what. Oh my god, who was that? Who was that? Bro! Yo! This dude literally just yeeted the living heck out of me. What the heck was that, man? <laughs> what the heck did I. What the heck? That, that can't be it, right? He ran so fast. That chainsaw had to have been weightless. Okay, so on August 16th, 1995, local police discovered six bodies in an underground car park owned by De Dezo Software Incorporated. Five of the bodies were severely mutilated that they could not be identified, but one of them was identified as a former employee who was working late at 
exploit late on the night of the murders. Police caught the killer through the security surveillance cameras in the car park. The killer is awaiting trial and currently being locked down in a maximum security cell. The killer used a chainsaw to mutilate his victims. Intel says that he was fired two years ago from De Dezo and has since plotted his revenge. You're telling me that you were so fixated and that salty of being fired from your job, you decided to just grab a chainsaw and start bodying people? And my character, whoever I was playing as, was just wrong place, wrong time. I don't know why the heck you there that late, but all right. But yo, this game was pretty interesting, but it was pretty short. So what I'm going to do, guys, I'm going to go ahead and play one more game, and maybe that will be a little bit longer for the video. I'm not going to upload a four-minute clip. I'm not. That's pointless. So uh, let's get right on to the next game. I don't like that man but yo okay uh, guys this is the next game we're playing Krampus seeing as that Halloween is said and done I'm like why not throw a little holiday stuff into this I do not like the sound of that wow what time is it what is happening outside okay. there's a freaking storm outside I'll go down I guess and check out my Check on my boots. Okay. The sweets or sticks in them. Wait, what? <laughs> Pick up the light. Let's go check it out. All right. So we're... Uh, this, the aesthetic looks pretty cool. It reminds me a mixture of a PS1 horror game and puppet combos. And actually a little bit of um, uh, Dave Microwaves. If you guys remember me playing those uh, parody games, parody horror games, like the Door of the Explorer one. <laughs> See, we went to the supermarket to buy stuff. We'll be back, Mom. Well, okay, yeah, I mean, I was pretty vague. They may have got stuck outside because of that storm. Interesting, yeah. Uh... Getting hungry, I go take some I'll go take some chocolate. So what is it on the tree? I mean some it's just a tree. Okay. In the stocking? I mean, that's just where my like where I get like, you know, chocolate and stuff from, you know. Either it be hanging on the trees, a little treat or something, or it's in the stocking for Christmas or Christmas Eve. One or the other. Where the heck did where the heck am I supposed to get this chocolate? Oh. Oh. There's the chocolate. Yummy. What the heck was that sound? Yeah, what the heck was that sound, bruh? I should go check it out. No, you shouldn't. Yeah, but I really do enjoy the aesthetic of this game. It's very... Oh, what the heck? Go check your boots. Okay. Where is my boots? telling me to check my boots. Where's my boots? You can hide? No, it's gonna be something hunting me. Oh, there's my boots. What the heck? God, no. Why? Wait, what happened? What's in them? I haven't been a bad boy this year. Oh, is it cold in my boots? Wait. Oh! Who are you? Hey, my name is Max. We really have to leave. We really have to leave this place. I don't have my cage key, so I can't get you out. If you find a way out, could you please help me escape? Okay. Maybe a chimney could be a great way out. Dude, it's locked. We're supposed to. I don't have a key. How am I supposed to get out? Oh! Nice, got a key. Get me the heck up out of here, bruh. Wait, can I just let him out too? It's locked. Why would I, why would it only work for me? And what happens if I just ignore the other guy? Did 
It's locked. Okay. And I gotta get out too. And the, the freaking chimney is lit. So... I should find something to cut it. So I need to find kind of like a saw? I may need that water for later. Some water source. Maybe I could find a way to use it. Yeah. So I kind of peeped that with the uh, with the uh, chimney. But this is interesting. So I'm like, so is Krampus just going to chase us down or something? It's just a tree. Okay. Oh, wait. What is this? Wait, what did I just pick up? <gasps> oh, another key. I hear I hear another pair of feet. That's not good. That is not good. Oh, what if we went to go check on the cages? Hurry up, come on dude, get out. Does he follow me? He doesn't even follow me, dude. Oh! I got a ladder. That's cool. Maybe I need that to oh climb up the chimney and get out. Okay, okay, okay. Oh, oh no! Run! Run! Run boy! Oh! That's some butt cheeks, so I can't even get caught by this guy! Yo! Okay, 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 okay. Oh my god! Can I hit you? Man, hit him with the freaking thing! Like, clunk him upside the head, something! Man, he got to have moved. Oh, there he goes. Oh, there we go. Why did I have to stand in one spot to do that? Let's go! Good ending, my boy! Got everybody out of there, let's go! Thank you for playing! Now there is a bad ending to this game, if you guys do want to get or figure out the bad ending of this game, go ahead and check out this game on itch.io, it's pretty interesting, like I said, I love the art style of it, it reminds me of an old classic PS1 game mixed in with public combos and also um, just, you know, all of the indie games that I did play combined into one, so it was pretty cool. That sound effect is very freaking disturbing, but I hope you guys did enjoy this video. Hope you also like, comment, subscribe, and share it, and I'll see you guys in the next one.